The following is a men's War Games match. The rules of the match are as follows. Two teams will be contained in separate cages with one member of each team starting the match. At regular intervals, alternating members from each team will be released to enter the match. The team with the advantage will be the first to have a member released into the match. Once all competitors have entered, War Games officially begins. The match can be won by pinfall or submission. Exiting the cage will result in a forfeit. Now, let the War Games begin! The Prince has arrived. A man who has passed judgment on all of WWE. Introducing first, representing the Judgment Day from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Ben Balor. Hey guys, do you realize that we're mere moments away from waging war? Guys, a tough spot to be in starting war games, but soon we'll have the numbers on his side. You're right, Cole. It's up to him to utilize the advantage, direct his team, and be ruthless. Yeah, but it's really critical. He needs to stay alert and stay active. And if he gets injured or knocked out, the numbers advantage is meaningless. He's in perhaps the best physical condition of his life. He knows what it takes to reach the top here in WWE. The son of a dream looking to realize his destiny in WWE. situation is how you prove it. He needs to lead his team through this match, even though the numbers will be constantly against them. Well, he looks determined. You have to expect he's going to go full force when the bell rings. He's got to incapacitate his opponent to try to negate the advantage. Listen, every move, every strategy must be meticulously planned in this harsh structure. And we also know all it takes is one simple mistake, and that can be your undoing in war games. I hope you're ready, gentlemen, because war games are now officially underway. Brace for impact, everybody. This match is sure to create a rarely seen level of bedlam and destruction. Nothing pushes the envelope of in-ring mayhem like a War Games match. He just got sent flying into the opposite ring. Yeah. And Cody Rhodes reverses. Good golly. Utilizing his power and tossing him across the rings. Oh. Balor with the kick, Balor on the move. On oh, the basement drop kick. He 
Tosses him over and into the other ring. Into the corner. This can't be good. Counting down the seconds until this match becomes a bit lopsided. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Out of the small holding cage to only make way toward the beaches of Normandy. Oh, nice deep arm drag. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. We're going to free the arm and does just that. As if the numbers advantage wasn't enough, looking under the ring for a weapon now. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Well scattered reversal there. And now, officially in the fray. It pays to be coming in and have more friends than foes in the cage. One of the most unique matches any superstar will ever be a part of. How does that affect someone in there, Corey? Well, Corey, it's hard to say. You really have to keep your head on a swivel in there. Not only because of the other team, but your own teammates might become a hindrance inside the cage. I think you have to really look out for yourself first and your teammates second. He's one step ahead there. Oh, look at this. What a heck of a It is the Slim Blade. And with his coming entrant, the teams will officially be evened up. Oh, a close line. They're lining up their opponent. What do they have in mind? And here we go. They're on a mission to save the day and won't be stopped. is just having his way here. Yeah, Cody Rhodes is clearly in control. Oh, okay. Searching under the ring, thinking something there can give their team a boost. Oh, across the back of the neck. Entering the ring now, hoping to give their squad some relief. And he has an answer for Grayson. Drop down with the Bulldog. Going up the cage now, must have some sort of strategy in mind. Oh, Jumper! Oh, Hold on here. What good reason does he have to be climbing up the cage now? Going up the cage now, must have some sort of strategy in mind. Finn Balor has his sights set solely on his opponent now. I'm not sure the top of the cage can handle all of this chaos. They'll advise to be up there. Your feet hitting the outside means your team forfeits the match. Crash and burn. Oh, what a nasty landing. At the worst possible time, too. We've got a numbers advantage incoming as the countdown is about to run out. Send flying over to the other ring. And for the team on the wrong side of this entry, things have gotten that much more brutal. He knew that was coming. Blow for blow, high above the rail. 
wards off that offense from Priest. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him. Like what? Uh, he's got uh oh. Manages to land a big headbutt. Crucifix powerbomb. The young Dominic Mysterio looking to fight off the audience here. Sami Zayn retaliates.
keep him down. sugarcoated gentlemen this is about the toughest test you can face here in the wwe and they passed it with flying colors